This is WYMT Mountain Sports, your home for the Kentucky Wildcats and local high school sports. At least one Kentucky track and field athlete will return from the NCAA championships with a medal. Sophomore Shaquilla Saunders earning a bronze medal in the women's long jump competition, breaking her previous school record by more than nine inches. Her distance of 22 feet, one and three quarters inches is not only a school record, but also a personal best for Saunders. It was a great finish. I would love to have a better place, but <laughs> I'm blessed and I'm thankful for the uh, mark that I received. A long time coming in, I was surprised, but I'm thankful that it finally came, and I hope I can stay there. In our final Food City Golf Tip of the Week, Floyd County native Ryan Martin demonstrates the best way to execute a shot from the bunker. Hello, everybody. This is Ryan Martin. We are uh, here in the bunker today. We're going to talk a little bit about bunker play and how the easiest way to get the golf ball out of the bunker is. I've got a drill that I teach some of the amateurs that I, I have them set it up on a tee just to get the feel of what it feels like to get it out. That way they start committing to it. Still gonna hit maybe just about an inch behind it. What I see most of the time is people will make a long backswing and then they quit. They stick it in and quit. We've really gotta make sure that our whole body is going through. We all have trouble with long bunker shots. So I've got a nine iron out here today. Now, I'm not really gonna change very much, but I am going to still hit about an inch behind the ball, little, keep, my, keep my pressure going through, and we're gonna try and get it back there to that back pin. So the nine iron is actually, it, it doesn't dig as bad, and for longer shots, for amateurs and, and the, the average player, a nine iron or a pitching wedge, even you know, to a gap wedge, it's going to help you a lot filling it and getting it out of the bunker. 